Are you facing error with iTunes like this, which says, iTunes library cannot be read because it was created by a newer version of iTunes, then keep watching for the solution. Launch the file manager, and locate this PC. In my Windows 11, I can locate it from quick access. Click on it. Next click on C drive, next navigate to users folder, and then click on the user name, which you have set for the computer, from the bunch of folders. Next locate the music folder, and click on it. Inside the music folder, you will find the iTunes folder, click on the it. Finally you will find the iTunes library file, just permanently delete that file or rename it, in my case, I will delete it, once the file is deleted. So it's the moment of truth, let's see if the iTunes is working or not. If you are still with me, like and subscribe to my channel. And as you can see, the iTunes is working successfully. Now that you have the iTunes installed, check my next video on sideloading.